Kiki Palmer dropped shocking truth bomb on her ex, Darius Jackson. So you guys, Kiki Palmer is dealing with some heavy stuff, filing a restraining order against her ex, Darius Jackson, for serious abuse. Darius Jackson is clapping back, calling it a revenge drama. His brother chips in his two cents, and now Kiki Palmer's mom is coming out to speak out for the first time to defend her daughter's honor. You guys, it is a whole messy drama and a courtroom showdown. But before we get right into that, hey royalties, kings and queens, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl royalty, back with another celebrity relationship gist. To my returning subscribers, you guys are the re-MVP and if you're new, you're so welcome. Please consider being a part of us by hitting the subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to not miss another video. Thank you. So you guys, today we've got some real talk about Kiki Palmer's life that we need to dive into. Kiki, you know, the amazing actress, singer, and all-around boss lady? Well, turns out she's going through some tough stuff in her personal life, and we've got the deets. So Kiki's been in the spotlight for her talent, from Akila and the Bee to Hustler, but now there is a darker side to her story. She's been open about filing a restraining order against her ex, Darius Jackson, accusing him of some really heavy, heavy stuff. We are talking about physical, emotional, and verbal abuse. According to court documents obtained by US Weekly, Kiki is saying Darius was not only violent with her, but also threatened her and their little one. It's heartbreaking to hear that she claims he cheated and exposed her to some serious health risk. Kiki is saying he controlled every aspect of her life, from finances to her career, and get this, she's even saying he was abusive to their one-year-old son. Ouch. Kiki tried to leave multiple times, but she says Darius always found a way to keep her around. The breaking point? A terrifying incident where he allegedly assaulted her in front of her child. It's tough to even imagine what she's going through. US Weekly report that Kiki claimed that she had a security footage from a November 5th incident in which Jackson trespassed into her home without her knowledge or consent and threatened her before longing for her neck, striking her throwing her over the couch and stealing her phone. Now, Darius is denying everything, saying Kiki is just out for revenge, blaming jealousy and fame. He insists he's innocent and loves both Kiki and their son. He's even ready to fight for joint custody, claiming Kiki is trying to ruin his life. Hmm. You guys, as soon as this news dropped, Darius Jackson took to his ex account and he shared a photo of himself and his son with a caption, I love you son, see you soon. And it's making a lot of people to wonder like, how come, why are you just posting this just when this news drops? What a coincidence, right? Some folks could not understand why he was making that post at that time, like this person who says that's how you know he crazy when they start texting and messaging in front. Another person says that baby somewhere playing with his toys, he can't read this S. Another user said narcissistic response, who writes to her 8 months old on Twitter. You guys, beyond this post, do you remember a couple of months ago? The drama between Darius Jackson and Kiki Pama with Usher serenading Kiki, what she was wearing, Darius tweet talking about you're a mother. Yeah, if you can't remember that story, then I can't help you. Okay, you can just click that card that drops right now to go watch all of those. But yeah, given everything that happened at that time with Darius complaining about Kiki's outfit to Usher's concert and how she composed herself before him with Usher serenading her, it's making people put two and two together and conclude that definitely Darius might have been controlling. But how controlling was he as to control very Kiki Palmer even to her finances and to the point of verbally and physically abusing her? After the whole Osha you're a mother situation, a lot of people did not know where Kiki stood with her man, especially those of her fans that were rooting for her only for them to see her hanging out with him on her birthday. They had a whole live section looking good and everything seemed good. So a lot of people could not tell where she was with her relationship with Darius Jackson. Were they together or were they no more together? They seemingly look happy together sharing drinks on her birthday. 
But then during an interview with Today Hooter and Jenna, she was asked about her relationship with Darius Jackson. Hey, are you I'm, happy? Yes, life is good. I have nothing but gratitude, honestly. Seriously. For the relationship. <laughs> are you she gave the impression that life was good and everything was good and it was cool. At least that was the little she was willing to spill. So even though she did not say categorically if they were still together or not, she pretty much gave the impression that they were cool. And fast forward to today, the news is dropping all of a sudden, Court C US Weekly, that Darius Jackson, first of all, is not her ex and she is filing restraining order. Hmm. We we'll see Darius Jackson with the baby a lot of times at around the airport, at the aquarium. He is very much a hands-on dad. But all of these details coming up about him hurting the mother in front of the baby is giving crazy, y'all. And of course, the fans, Kiki Palmer's fans once more, is going crazy, y'all. But the drama did not stop there. Darius Jackson's brother... Sarunas J. Jackson decided to chip in his two cents. He said in a tweet, The most disgusting, vile, abusive, manipulative person I have ever encountered in my entire life abuses almost everyone. Y'all will see. Just send positive energy to the babies. Any child in the middle of something like this does not deserve it at all. Wow, so damn sad. And guys, this starts to get the public confused. People started taking camp and sides like this commenter who said, I definitely believe him. Kiki is a Virgo. And if you've ever been in a relationship with a Virgo, you will know when they get hurt, they can become some of the most lying, manipulative people ever. They will have the whole world believing you did something wrong to them. Whole time, it will all be bold faced lies and they are very spiteful and bitter people. <laughs> Another commenter says, I don't know, but I feel like Kiki a little narcissistic herself i'm not gonna lie lml because after doing that song with usher she was definitely giving me jetta pinkett i pray for them all though another person says nobody else paying attention to the baby's part or oh, am i overthinking like yo that's so true could kiki be expecting another baby another child with darius jackson oh my god well i don't know maybe we're really overthinking and then this commenter says I miss the days when what goes on in this house slash family stays in this house slash family. I know that's right. And so this user says, see what having the babies do? Kiki never been in the blocks for drama. I know, and that is absolutely true. Prior to Darius Jackson, Kiki has never been in the blocks for drama, but lately, especially this year, it has been from one to another. Anyway, Miss Sharon Palmer came out, she spoke her piece, and this is what she said. I went to Sharonis over a year ago and told him that his brother was abusive to my daughter. And he said, uh, well, I used to be like that too. Wow, once again, this got the public confused and the camps began to shift. Like this commenter who said, Mama said they went to him a year ago, their baby eight months. So we still had a baby for a man who was going upside our head. Okay, I am on nobody's side. I love Kiki, but if he was abusive over a year ago, when the mama went to him about it, that baby eight months, why get pregnant by him? The math never mattered for real. I'm baffled. Girl, your math ain't matting. This user says, knowing her mother doesn't even show her face to the media like that, you know it's true. We stand with Kiki. This ninja god Kiki mom's talking, he don't piss me off. Another person says, of course, from the camp of the angry users, why do people feel the need to take everything to social media? This too much. Another commenter says, real mamas don't play about their daughter and we don't play about Kiki either. You didn't learn from the Usher situation, now this? Oh, okay. And this user say this is so messy, hate that for Kiki. Absolutely, y'all. This situation is really, really messy. I hate that for Kiki. I hate that she's been on the blogs lately for negativity in the midst of having a child and to be honest really that is why as much as possible we as a people as a community should discourage single motherhood having babies out of wedlock and you know just jumping into a random relationship if you see a red flag you better step back because if the mother had gone to meet Dara's brother to complain about his behavior then the red flag was there there's no need to compromise some things especially when it has to do with abuse so 
We should encourage our young ladies to not compromise, especially in dark situations like this. As a matter of fact, Darius Jackson's brother, Serena, also left his own comment under Kiki Mama's post. He said, quote me, I never once said that to Sharon, not once in my life. I have never been abusive to any of the women I ever been involved with. I'm not going to keep on with this circus, but Sharon, the world is about to hear your voice very soon and the threats you made to my family be well everyone i know it's easy to get caught up in this but make no mistake that all of this is very sad hmm. seriously you guys this is a lot and it's looking like it's going to be even messier in the coming days or weeks this commenter says you are part of the problem because mama was just kicking with Darius on the podcast so now i'm confused they most likely will be back and forth, you know, between Kiki's camp and Dara's camp. Maybe, who knows, maybe clips might be leaking, voice notes might be dropping. Things are definitely going to happen. But this is really sad because there's a baby involved in all of this. It's a heavy situation and we're sending positive vibes to Kiki and her little one. What do you all think about all of this? It's tough to take sides when you're not in their shoes, right? Let's hope for a fair resolution and healing for everyone involved. You guys share your thoughts in the comment section. You know I love to hear your opinion. And as always, thank you so much for watching. If you did get to this point of the video, do not forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the post notification bell to not miss another video. And until the next one, remember to pray, walk out, walk smart, and slay. Bye-bye.